This is your Ripple Maker 2's main screen. Here is the gallery where all the Ripple's dynamic content will be located. You can also find your custom content here too. Skip to any channel by clicking on the gallery and the channel name. Tap any image on screen to print. You can also add any image from the Ripple's dynamic content to your favorites by long tapping on the image and clicking on the heart. From this menu, you can also adjust the diameter of the print size for one print. The Ripple Maker 2 prints in three sizes. You can, coming soon, edit your designs and add tags. When ready, click print. Now you have a favorites folder with your favorite image. To remove it from favorites, long tap and unclick the heart. Mobile queue images will be here. When sent using the Ripples app or web app, automatic mode is set up in the Ripples cloud and will randomly select an image that you've chosen, speeding up the process of selection. On the main screen, you'll see Wi-Fi connectivity, and on the left-hand corner, your pod status at a glance. The question mark offers you tips and tricks. In the menu, you'll be able to find your organization and location name. Click this to scan the web app QR code and send mobile queue images. Under notifications, we will send you important messages. In the settings menu, you can adjust the print quality. If selected auto, it will print according to the pod type. You can also change from standard to an enhanced print and set your cup diameter default. For content syncing, click Sync and this will help download any new images. Mobile content, if you want to clear it, click Clear or Delete All Content. Under Connectivity, you'll see your Wi-Fi. You can disconnect or change. Your MAC address is located here. And to test to see if you're online, click Network Check. It will tell you if you're connected to the internet. Under System, you can change your language. See your software version and update. And push any configuration changes. Or restart your machine. To give support remote access, toggle this switch and give them the access code. Under Maintenance, you will have print quality. You can do a test print and follow the wizard to solve any problems. Daily maintenance should be done once a day. Pod status will show us the current state of your pod and the approximate extract level, what pod is installed, and the date. To buy more pods, click Store and scan the QR. When changing a pod, click Pod Replacement. The Reports section will tell you about your print count according to week or month. This can be handy. Support. You will find the phone number and email of your local support team and a QR code to chat with them on WhatsApp. Under the About, you can find lots of important information, your location, serial number, model number, software version, and installed pod. Thanks for watching.